Hi everyone, Jeremy Avery with the Ecosystem App Engineering Team here to give you a look at the alpha release of our Red Hat OpenShift database access product. Let's get started by taking a quick look at the OpenShift cluster we'll be working with. I started by deploying an application called FruitShop to the cluster. FruitShop is a Quarkus based app. Here we can see it in topology view, so let's go ahead and add a new service from the developer catalog. Here we have a new entry called Connected Database, where you can see a tile for each of the providers registered with our system. We'll go ahead and select MongoDB Atlas, as we know it has the collection we wish to connect with, and hit Connect. On the screen, we see each of the instances that was discovered according to the credentials we provided in the discovery workflow. We select the DBAS Cluster 1 instance, which has our fruit list, and hit Connect. Back over in Topology, we can now see that next to our fruit shop, we have a representation for the DBAS connection. Our next step is to take and drag the arrow over from our application to the DBAS object and create a binding connector. At this point, the pods for the application are restarted, and we should now have database connectivity for our app. Once more, let's use the route for our application to check on our list, ensure that our database functionality is working correctly. And here we can see that we now have the list to return to users. And lastly, let's just go ahead and add a new entry to test our write functionality as well. Success! This concludes our demo of the alpha release for the database as a service product. Thanks for your time.